Hello everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That. We're the inspirational channel that goes behind the scenes and interviews some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. So today we're going to be doing another Tech Tuesday, and in the previous segment we had talked about the uh, downloading program that we utilize as far as pulling some videos from YouTube, so on and so forth. Um, but today we wanted to get back into that segment and show you the shortcut program that we had mentioned. So today we're going to be talking a little bit about the uh, shortcut program that we we had mentioned within our last segment about the the YouTube as far as downloading the videos and how we utilize this program. We're not going to go real in depth with editing with shortcut, but we're going to show you how to pull that video from your folder and then you know edit like a short small segment and save it within your folder. Now, if there's something that you guys want to see out there, maybe you guys do utilize Shotcut and you're having some holdups with, you know, editing within Shotcut, let us know. We'll put out a separate small segment for that issue. So you'll see here we got the Shotcut pulled back up again here. Um, within Shotcut, you'll want to go up into your open folder and you'll see the folder that's right here. This is the one that we had downloaded from the uh, downloading program that we showed you in the previous segment. Uh, the protest, uh, they're one of their newer videos, great video. Okay, so you see the, the folder box, you know, opened up the protest video within your viewable segment here. What you'll want to do is grab this video, you left click on your mouse, drag it down into your timeline, and make sure it goes all the way to the beginning of the timeline right there so now we got it into our timeline and you'll see the minutes and you can actually shrink this down and like i said we'll go into a lot of the um more editing within shot cup this is very simple this is something simple that we do utilize um a lot just to do little short segments and you know pull some information and videos for any of the bands, entertainers, whoever we may be putting out there to just, you know, show you guys some short segments. So of course, what we're going to do here is we're going to do like, maybe if we want a 15 second video, just to show you guys this new uh, video that's coming out by them. So I scrolled it up here to around 17.12 seconds. I want to cut out that beginning. So this is the cut bar. So I'll cut that out and then it'll move your timeline over to the beginning and right now we're about 1703 seconds so let's say we wanted to stop right here um maybe at let's see we'll go so let's say we wanted to stop at 20 seconds instead of like 15 seconds so we'll stop at 20 it's about 19.23 and we'll cut and then we will Cut the end of the video so now you got your your short little segment right here so now all you have to do is you'll click on this little link box that says YouTube and then you'll click on export file okay so once you've um, you know clicked on your export file this folder comes up and you can save it in any folder that you would like you know depending upon if you have a CDE drive whatever you know your folders files I'd recommend of course organizing your folders and files so that way you're just not saving stuff all over the place and you know lose them so we do is we have a we have a protest file and then um we're gonna you know we'll just quickly name this the protest video so then you click save and then as you see it's a scrolling through and re-recording it to be compatible through the mp4 uh, for youtube and as you see it's downloaded it right here so now it's in your uh your file folder box Okay, so now we clicked on the box uh, where the file has uh, downloaded and you'll see here that the file has uh, downloaded the 20 seconds that we wanted uh, to go within our, uh, to utilize within an edit that we're going to be doing. So you'll click on that and you'll see that the video will play. So as you see, it's a pretty simple, easy, uh, you know, steps that you can utilize. And like I said, we do like to use a shortcut for for this quick and easy steps uh, we do utilize uh, DaVinci but DaVinci is our main editing platform um, that we utilize when we're doing our uh, total video edits but these are for like small short segments so if you want to use a uh, shortcut for that definitely recommend that program and again we'll have all the links everything uh, down below to kind of show you guys um, where you can uh, download this so if there's anything else and other further segments if you have any questions 
or if you're held up on something, do let us know. We'll put out uh, you know other helpful tips and uh, videos throughout the month and over the over the year uh, as we can. And sometimes they may be a little spaced out as far as timing, uh, but we'll try to get to as many as we can throughout the year. So hopefully this helps and we'll see you guys on the next one.